Sunday already? That means that you're here. I can celebrate. It's Sunday. Yay! Kids Church! Oh, I'm so glad that you are here today. And we're going to learn more about our friend Jesus. I'm so excited. Are you? Yay! Well, we're going to start by singing an awesome song. But you need to make sure that you're up and ready so that we're ready to celebrate. Are you standing up straight? Have you got one arm over here? Have you got another arm over here? Can you put your hands on your head? Can you jump up and down? Yay! Let's go! Hello, my little friends. I'm so happy to see you again. The Lord is say hello. Hello. Are you ready for the story? Put your listening ears on together with the Lord. Is. What does the Bible say today about our friend Jesus? Oh, look at this. Jesus received some very, very sad news. Let me see your sad face. The sad news was that his friend, Lazarus, was very sick. He had two sisters, Martha and Mary, and they sent somebody to tell Jesus. But guess what? Jesus said, this sickness is going to not end in death. He made lots of promises. And he said to his disciples, let's stay here i'm still gonna tell the people about how much god loves them he stayed for two full days before going to see his friend lazarus but by this time lazarus was dead so jesus said to his friends friends come let's go i need to go wake our friend up he's asleep and the disciples said oh if he's asleep he's gonna be fine then Jesus said, no, 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 Lazarus is dead. So off they went to see Lazarus and the sisters. And when they got there, Martha came up crying to Jesus. And all the other people that were with her were crying. And Jesus said, where is he? But Martha said to Jesus, Lord, if you were here, my brother would not be dead. And Jesus was so sad, so heartbroken that he also cried. And even when Mary came, she said the same thing to Jesus. She said, Lord, if you were here, my brother would not be dead. Guess what, my little friends? Jesus, the son of God was crying. So Jesus said, where is he? Show me where Lazarus is. Okay, let's go and see Lazarus, my little friends. Because the sisters and all the Jews walked with Jesus to show him the dead man in the cave. And everybody was crying and so sad. Jesus was crying. And there was the cave for Lazarus. 
And now, my little friends, this is the best part of the story. When Jesus got to the cave, he said to the sisters and everyone that was there, remove the stone. But Martha said, oh Lord, no, we can't. He's been in there for four days. He's gonna cause a big stinger bomb. It's gonna stink and be yucky here. And Jesus said, did I not tell you that if you believe you will see God's glory? So they moved the stone. Oh, they moved that big stone out of the way. And then Jesus said with a very loud voice, Lazarus, come out. Let's see my little friends. Oh, here comes Lazarus. He's alive. And Jesus said, untie him. Untie him and let him go. Is Lazarus going to celebrate his alive? Yay! <laughs> Lazarus came back to life. The dead man became alive. And all the people that were there with the sisters believed in Jesus, the Son of God. Hello, Lazarus. Hello. <laughs> it's good to be alive. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Bye, my little friends. <laughs> How did Jesus do that? That is so amazing. Jesus is so strong. <gasps> wow. If Jesus can do that, we can pray for anything and he can help us with it. Should we do that right now? We're going to take how many fingers from here? Five fingers from here and five fingers from there. And we're going to bring them together for prayer. Lord Jesus, you are so strong. That is so amazing what you did. Will you help us, Lord, when we're facing big things? Help us in Jesus' name. Amen. Awesome. Parents, this week, we're going to focus on how awesome and strong Jesus must be that he could do that. And we can celebrate what Jesus did. This week, remind your toddlers how strong Jesus is. And if anything comes up this week that you think you can pray together for, remind your toddlers, let's stop and pray for Jesus because he is strong and he can help us. Have an amazing week, guys, and we can't wait to see you next week. Bye!